Good morning. Uh, if you're getting this, it's probably Monday morning and you are about to attempt your first assignment. Uh, so in class assignment number one, um, just please follow along. We'll give you some brief instructions. So first of all, um, you will find your assignment under the Blackboard under the Assignments tab. Uh, and when you open that up, you will see your assignment number one, as well as the submission link and what will also be this video. Um, so what I want you to do is open up all three of these files here. In class assignment one, the PRISM handbook and also the PRISM snapshots. My dogs are barking. One second. And I'm back. Sorry about that. Uh, so what you'll be doing is you'll be opening up all three of these files uh, and I'll show you what they look like. So the very first one is just the in-class assignment um, and it's actually quite small, I would imagine, for the very first 7.5% assignment. Um, and what you'll be doing is that you'll be going to the Friday Harbor website, which is this link right here. You'll be answering all of the yellow uh, highlighted questions. Um, saving this and then submitting it in the assignment uplink, um, also located under assignments. A uh, couple things I do want you to take your time with is um, when you go through this, remember that Friday Harbor is going to be our scenario. So take your time with the website. I even put a little introduction here or a little stop point here saying, wait before you attempt the next section, spend a few minutes going through the website. Um, this first page here on the left hand side that you're looking at is mostly just find the information and fill it out. A couple more critical thinking questions down here on your actual opinions. And then over here, we're going to be using a thing called prism segments. Now prism segments are um, uh, companies have been paid to break down Canada as a bunch of different markets, uh, target markets. And I believe there's about 64 of them. And what you're going to be doing is based on the information that you've been able to gather and just read about on Friday Harbor, you will have to come up with four different target markets or market segments that you think would be able to afford and appreciate living on Friday Harbor Resort. Um, I, and I'll show you what those files are. Now, there are two. There's a 2012 and a 2005. Um, the 2018 actually isn't available yet, but every three years or so, they come out with new ones. Um, the 2012 has a lot more information. It's very detailed. The 2005 is a little bit more updated, but it's fairly similar. So up to you which ones you want to use. Either are fine. Um, and I'll show you the 2012 one. So here you have a 174 page document. It's huge. There's a lot of information. But what I really want you to do is go through um, and start reading um, information on these individual uh, people, these groups of people. So as an example here, uh, the very first one, it's, they're called the cosmopolitan elite. They're very wealthy, they're middle-aged and they're older families. Now, what you will need to do is read through all of their, their descriptions. So they tell you how much money they make, um, what kind of household income they have, where do they live, how do they think, and then also some of the stuff that they like to do. So this one here, they love fish and seafood and organic vegetables. They like golf equipment and gourmet food stores and going to art galleries. Um, this one here, and they make a lot of money. So when it comes to the actual assignment, I might say market segment number one, cosmopolitan elite, um, and then tell you what the rationale is. Now, please do not copy and paste any of that information unless it's maybe a graphic. Other than that, do not copy and paste. I will just give you zero if I see you just pulling their sentences. The idea is it's a rationale. So you will take that. It's about two pages on each target market. Take those two pages and shrink it into a, a paragraph or two on why you think um, the cosmopolitan elite would be able to enjoy Friday Harbor. They have the money. They have uh, they're educated. They like golf equipment. They like fish and seafood. And there's a really nice fish and seafood restaurant there. Um, they like going and there's a full uh, golf course there. Um, they like boat shows. Well, there's a huge marina and a lot of boats. You see where I'm going with this. Um, there are probably of the 64, 20 or more segments that actually would make sense. What I'm looking for here is that you are able to really describe why. So in this rationale, it will be a, a good chunk of text. 
um, you being able to describe why that's a good fit. Now, where this fits into your major assignment is now this is all about Friday Harbor as a whole. Um, as you complete your, your major assignment, which is choosing a restaurant, you will also be using these prism segments to identify who would go to your restaurant. Now, out of the 20 or so people that you think can probably go to Friday, Friday Harbor as a whole, there's probably three, four, five, six um, of those individual ones that would love to go to your restaurant because they like the style of food that you, you give. Um, so much of this market segment rationale um, material that you create might be able to be, be pulled and put right into your major assignment. Okay, so that's it for now. Um, it's Monday morning when you're when you're watching this on Tuesday or Wednesday, depending on when your classes drop in, ask me questions, or if you have it completed by then, you can just show it to me and share your screen. Uh, make sure specifically in this area that you include a lot of information. I will be a little bit um, harsh on marking in that area because it's really important. Okay. Other than that, have a great week and I'll see you in a few days.